Hey guys, Eric here with Import Apart again. Uh, in reference to the other video on the Saturn drive-by-wire throttle bodies that pertain to the 2002 and 2003 Saturn View and the L300 from 2000 to 2005, uh, I'm going to describe, this is for your, your, your L series guys, uh, how to get the throttle body off without pulling the intake platinum. There's another video on YouTube uh, that shows uh, a rough way of how to pull one of these, say you're in the salvage yard or off your own car. I'm going to show you the fast way to take one of these off. Uh, it's literally a three minute operation. So if it's mounted like this in the vehicle, you have your intake tube that bolts to the, the screws, clamps onto here, and it goes through your air box or your air flow meter. You want to pop the clips loose on the top of the air lid, disconnect your air flow meter, and take the clamp off of this and remove that. The next thing you want to do is pull the air box bottom out. I believe there's one 10 millimeter that holds that in. Once that is out, you'll be looking at the throttle body. You have one electrical connector right here. You'll have, uh, this is for your uh, crankcase ventilation here, and then you have one, two, three vacuum ports, and two coolant lines. Uh, these come off very easily. Uh, this clamp may give you some trouble. Uh, just be very careful with it as it's a one-time use clamp. Sometimes you can reuse them, but in worst case, you can put a screw clamp on here and it'll be just fine. Now, this is where it gets tricky. Uh, if you look at all the other instruction, instructions on the internet, you'll notice that they want you to pull the intake plenum, which, re which requires new gaskets and replacing lots of clamps that you have to break to get apart on the intake plenum. That is not what you want to do. There's no reason to do all that. So what you'd like to do uh, is these are, these are bolted on a Saturn view. However, there are studs on, a, on an L-series. So when you take the nuts off the studs, the throttle body will run right into the timing covers. You cannot get it off, you can't lift it up, but before you pull the nuts off, what you want to do is take a hammer and a punch or maybe even a, an extension and you want to smash the threads on the outside of the nut. Basically what you're doing is you're destroying the thread so when you try to take the nut off, it locks up and instead it takes the stud out of the intake plenum. There's, these two are very easy to do. This one is a little more challenging, but you can still get it quite easily. Once you do that, the throttle body will simply just pull straight up. You don't have to take any of the external bolts out, external torque sports bolts out, and you don't have to uh, take any gaskets or hoses loose that you would normally have to by removing the plenum. Hopefully, this will help you guys get this out, and you can reuse those uh, when you go put when you go back together. You can simply just push them in, just as a bolt would be. You've pretty much just turned the stud and nut into a bolt and you saved yourself a lot of time and some money and parts. So hopefully this helps you guys. This is Eric with the Port Apart, and should you need one of these, please get a hold of us at 314-502-3104. Thanks.